In this Playwright tutorial, we are going to see very commonly used terminologies in Playwright Automation Test. So these are the five keywords which we will be using while writing the Playwright Automation Test. The very first one is required. Second one is async keyword. Third one is await. And fourth one is page. And the last one is expect. So let's look at each keyword, what exactly that does in the Playwright automation tool. So the very first one is required. So we will use the required to include the Playwright model in the current JavaScript, JavaScript file or to use the Playwright model in the current JavaScript file. So that's the reason we are using the required keyword to include the Playwright model in the current JavaScript file. And the second and third keyword is async and await. So async is a function and await is a keyword and that will be written inside the async function only. So we can write async, sorry, await keywords or await keywords with the expressions. So we can write zero or more await expressions within the async function. And Whenever each time a sync function is called, so it returns you the new promise value, which will be resolved with the value written by the async function, or it can be rejected with the exception. So basically, it is a similar to the try and catch block, guys. So whenever a sync function is called, so it gets the promise value, or it, it can get the any exception. That is a rejected value at high level. So let's look at the another keyword page. So it is a browser context object. By using this context object, we can open the any URL and also we can interact with browser. So we can perform the actions on the web browser elements. And the last keyword is expect. So it is a library for JavaScript and TypeScript. So it is in, in, intended for using the with the test runner called uh, just or the playwright test. So basically we are using a expect keyword to write the better assertions for end-to-end -end testing and as well as the component testing. So assertions we are using to validate whether element is displayed or any web element contains the text value or any web element contains the specific test. So those kind of validations can be written by using the expect keyword so these are the very commonly used term terminologies in the playwright automation test